the GOAT of football, has one more chance of becoming a FIFA World Cup champion. Argentina are also on a 36-match unbeaten run and fans have flocked in their millions from South America to watch them in Qatar. A couple of months ago, I watched Messi dazzle Wembley with 87,000 Argentinian fans as he lifted the finalissima trophy. It was an amazing experience that I will never forget. Saudi Arabia were really good in qualifying and they're also Qatar's next door neighbour so they'll be used to the climate. Will they provide Argentina a big test today? The vlog will be the same style of the England one yesterday. I've got friends out in Qatar that will send me the footage from the game and I'll react to it from my home in the United Kingdom. The Chiefs of Argentina and Saudi Arabia! then the teams are out we are ready Argentina versus Saudi Arabia let's go Argentina I want Messi to do this oh my god a minute and 36 seconds Di Maria created it brilliantly on the right hand side came into Lataro Martinez just couldn't get the shot away the tackle came straight to Messi on his left foot I expected the net to bulge there but good save by the Saudi goalkeeper a minute and 36 seconds and Messi has already hit the target this is a sign of things to come. But there's a free kick here for Argentina in a really good position. Let's have Messi whip it in. Actually, I scratched that. There is a penalty check going on. Just as the free kick was taken in, the referee was whistling and heading over to the VAR monitor. Now, this is the benefit with being in the UK and watching it on TV. I can actually tell you what's going on. And it's from the corner that was just taken in and a Saudi player has completely wrestled an Argentinian player to the floor. And I believe this is going to be a penalty. He's given it. He has given a penalty to Argentina. To be honest, it's definitely a penalty. He pulled Paredes over. So here we go. This is the moment. Well, nine minutes in, Messi should have had two. It's a brilliant take and penalty. Just walked up to it and just let the, let the goalkeeper make his move and put it in the net. <laughs> well, I'll tell you what, this game is very, very open now. And I'm really impressed with the way that Saudi Arabia are playing football in the midfield. They look quick. They look compact. They look really well organised against Argentina. I think the penalty was soft looking back on it. But Saudi are coming out to play and they're playing very well. Bye, that was so tight. That was so tight. For me, at that angle, it looks like he's on. So we need to see that again. That, ah, oh, Messi though. What a run, what a finish. He's looking like he wants it. And it's 2-0. It's a brilliant goal from Martinez, that. And he scored the first goal in the final, Lissima, and he scored the second goal in the World Cup. Latara Martinez, brilliant slip ball through. Martinez could have squared it, but it's a wonderful, wonderful chip. Saudi Arabia were going with the high press, and that's sometimes what happens. They just get put in their place. Brilliant goal from Argentina. There is a VAR check going on. And it's going to be offside. Wow. Still 1-0. Wow, what a game this is. 
Oh, wow, everything so far. Penalties, VAR twice, rash tackles coming in. I wish I was there. All right, then half time between Argentina and Saudi Arabia in the World Cup early kickoff for us in the UK. Hope you guys are enjoying the video so far. Leave a like and subscribe if you guys are. Let's talk half time. Obviously, the penalty incident was a bit of an interesting one because the same thing happened to Maguire yesterday. He got cuddled to the floor. This time it was on Paredes. I think it was soft, but it is a penalty. But how did it not get given on Maguire yesterday? Anyway, we won 6 2, so we're fine. Argentina have had the ball in the net four times. Only one of them has stood and it came from the penalty spot, which Lionel Messi, of course, tucked away. He had the ball in for a second from a brilliant through ball, but he was judged to be so tightly offside. The third one I thought was ridiculous. Lutaro Martinez, brilliantly chipped finish. He was an inch away. His, whole, his feet were onside, which is what body part he used to score. But his shoulder was off anyway. And then he had it in the net another time where he rounded the goalkeeper. So Argentina should be about 4 0 up. But I've been quite impressed with the way that Saudi Arabia are playing, to be honest. They've been combat, they've been disciplined. They're just pressing a little bit too high and getting caught by the through ball from Argentina. But a great half of football so far. Can Argentina hang on? <laughs> Wow, this is the World Cup. Al Sherry has just equalised for Saudi Arabia. Insane. It was a brilliant ball through. He took on Romero, put the ball through his legs, into the back of the net. No chance for Martinez because it was right at the side of the net. I would told you I was impressed with the Saudis and they've got themselves level. Fair play to them. Oh my goodness me, Aldessari with an absolute scream. And what is going on in this game? Argentina have had three goals ruled out and Saudi Arabia now lead. Brilliant goal as well. Just cuts inside, finesses straight into the top corner. <laughs> what a game and what a goal. <laughs> And breathe, ladies and gentlemen. What an unbelievable game of football. I'm so glad I did a reaction to this one because it was amazing. I felt like I was literally there. Uh, yeah, unbelievable performance from Saudi Arabia. Fantastic defending. They cut Lionel Messi out. They had the look of the draw. Goal line clearances, dramatic saves. Three goals ruled out from Argentina. Obviously, we got our Lionel Messi goal, which is, I'm sure, what everyone at the stadium, including myself, wanted. But Argentina just weren't at the races today. They got that goal. They got three others. The three others got disallowed. They just couldn't keep up with the defending of Saudi Arabia. I did say in my halftime report they were very dangerous. They got that goal two minutes after the uh, two minutes into the second half. That's a massive moment. Uh, I don't think this will be damaging for Argentina. I think they will come back strong, and I still think they'll win the group. However, this is massive for Saudi Arabia. Could this be their opportunity to get through to the round of 16 themselves? What a game. So there we go, guys. What an insane game. I hope you enjoyed the footage that I've got from Qatar and obviously my reaction from back in the UK. I did want Argentina to win, but credit where it's due to the Saudi Arabian team. They were absolutely fantastic. I'm so happy for them. If you have enjoyed this kind of video, make sure to smash the like, subscribe down below, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Peace out.